now in this video i am going to start the new series of the making the starbuck clone website here you can see in this starbuck uh, we have a multiple navigation see this one let me just do this and here we have this uh, rounded uh, images like that and in the bottom then this uh, basic recommendation this icon and when i just click on this this image will be slide and this types of a i think is this the yeah here you can see this two image are slide like that all this we make in the using the telvin css which is the css uh, utility of the css and we also use the mongodb for the login purpose here you can see when i click on the this login icon and this page will be open and if uh, already we have not login then click on the this login and sign up and this pop up will be display uh, sorry this pop up will be display and here we can enter a password if we are not register then we can go on the sign up page and this section will be appear after the email section and all this we are going to start this series and in that i use the react node js mongodb and express all three in the here in this project let's go on the vs code editor first and here first of all i install the uh, react for that go on the terminal section and open new terminal after that here i give the npx create react app enter okay i was not given the path that's why npx create react app and after that i give the same path because i want to in the same directory then after that i give the enter now this uh, react uh, installation is started uh it's uh, i think uh, take uh, approximately 1 to 2 minute uh i will back and or we can go on the website and see some feature here you can see this image will be coming and when i click here this image will be slide like that and this one already we i show you and when uh, i go on the gif section you can see in the top section uh, like this types of a appear this image slider and i think this menu yeah this menu when i was click on the here you can see in the feature section all this uh, card view are display when i was click on the only any time you can see only some image are display uh, this uh, and congratulation like this types of a item will be display and thank you for this and this is a for the gift section uh, if we go on the order section and here you can see has a some search bar okay i want to go again when i was click on the this search see it will be change and uh, here appear like this and when i was click here we can search some image anything like i search mumbai uh, like that now and press enter see uh, this map will be display the uh, location of that and we can show this like that yeah and uh, this location we can implement also and let's go on the another section here you can see we have a uh, navigation also in the order page also best seller drink like when i was click on the drink this types of menu will be coffee different type of a coffee section will be display i think installation is done or oh, no no a little bit taking time and this food one and merchant all this we can do all this and when i was go on the uh, page section see this page will be display like that uh, uh, first of all we log in then we can do and in store section uh, again we come uh, this search section when i was go on the this order and click here it will be redirect on the store this one now let's go on the i think installation is completed yeah our react will be ready let me just go run this npm 
start now let's uh, see yeah our react will be ready first of all we make the our front end part uh, from the everything we will make front end after that we continue the our back end now let me just go on here and in the src section in the app.js file let me just a little bit in the bottom and just delete all this we can delete everything and here we can use just, just fragment and go on the app.css here also I want to delete all this and let me just check uh, I think which font this is for that right click here go on the inspect I want to check uh, which font this is you can see the font family is uh, sodo sans and semi bold hollowed like this types of way if I remove this font uh, here then uh, which type of way let me enter okay these are also perfect uh, let me just see if this font is available in the google font or not here I paste this name okay this font is not available for here then we can use the our by default font no need of this and let me just come here and here let's uh, start the making this top section for that I want to come here and here in the SRC uh, section first of all we make a folder component in this folder we uh, make all this component and another folder will be the pages page these two and our one of the another folder which I stored all these images for that we can make a assist assist or you can give any name and uh, all these are done and for the navigation we can use the react router dom when i was clean then this image will be display for that react router i want to install let me open the another terminal here i give the npm i react router dom now this installation is started and it will be done approximately one to two scan and if we i go on the uh, packet.json section you can see uh, where is react router dom is installed 6.6 .6. now this part will be done and i want to also set up this for that uh, and here i use the redux also i was forgetted to tell you and for that redux, uh, redux i want to install the redux also here I give the uh, npm let me just give this npm i redux and we use the react uh, redux toolkits uh, also I want to install npm i react redux and its toolkits uh, let me just go on the here type redux let me just go on the redux and I want to install redux toolkits click here and getting a start let me just see the command where is yeah here this just copy this one and come in the here I can just paste this this taking I think some time yeah now our redux will be also install redux toolkits and everything will be now fine let me just go on here we create another folder also for the redux here I give the redux this will be the our ma managing the all the global now we have uh, make all this folder let me just uh, down this uh, because now no need of this and just uh, here you can see in the packet.json we have installed the uh, react uh, redux uh, uh, react router dom and redux uh, 
and toolkits in the here where is redux toolkits like this because this make our redux uh, for the uh, coding purpose easily that's why and now I was done this part let me just uh, close this file and this one now I want to set up the redux first of all in the page section we make uh, home page and home dot you can give the extension jsx or you can use the js here I use the js everywhere and when I was come here see this home and we make the gift page let me just go here and here give the gift make sure that your first letter of uh, this com uh, not this uh, this component may be file name will be for the convention we use the capital camel case like a first letter is a capital and inside the home page uh, just write a R A F C E and press enter this is a shortcut I use the VS code extension here you go the extension section here just type ES7 and where is uh, okay here you can ES6 uh, react redux or you can use the babel also es6 i think i my was uh, here i was using this one es7 plus uh, react redux native like this type of extension you can install this then you can write uh, just uh, only three lines uh, three words r a f c e or r a f c e you can see if you want to the arrow one arrow function or uh, some by default like that you can use it here i can give the r a f c e and press enter now this automatically generated uh, let me create another order and pay and store let me just create all this page order.js r a f c e press enter after that play pay and for that pay uh, dot js rafce we created an store now let me just create this store dot js we give the rafce press enter now i was created this and let me also cre create the this login when i just click on this then here you can see this types of will you dis uh, another go on the another page this profile section uh, when I just click here see it will be go on the profile and uh, this is a login page we will create later no problem first of all we go on the profile section for that here I created the profile page profile.js like that we have a uh, make the RFC let here also we have completed uh, making the our pages now we have done our pages now I want to set up the react router for that uh, let me just collapse this and go on the app dot index dot js file and here I remove this one because we don't no need of a sticky mode and now I want to just uh, import create uh, what is the name of the create uh, create uh, what is the name of the browser router yeah create browser router and uh, one more create uh, element I won't forget it uh, let me just uh, go on the this browser router website router react router dom and inside that I want to go on the click here uh, yes 6 and create bra create browser router router provider and uh, I want to use the element in this form like this form for that I want to install the create roots from element let me just do this create roots I think my suggestion is not create root from the element like that 
and we have done this part and one more things react provider I want to router provider sorry and let me just see which is yeah react router dom I want to import router provider yeah we have uh, almost done in this page in index.js let's set up this for that here in the top section mm, let me just do this and here we can give the const router and this will be the create browser router and inside we can create a create uh, what is create browser uh, create routes from element and inside this we make a array and inside this we can create a object like that here you can see like this types of way but we can use the element like this types of way we can create directly for that I want to also import the routes and we can directly use from this let me just see and this array I want to remove here I can use the root ok this will be the right uh, root uh, from the path and here we give the path will be slash and here here I give the main will be the element and I imported the let me just give the app component ok let me just uh, yeah, this will be then the curly bracket and close this now let me just see ok I think I was not included as anything yeah here you can see it will be display but our router will be not set then why display ok by default here I display let me just set the route for that we get the router provider like that here in the official website you can see uh, where is ok not this one uh, where I go on the top mm, this one yeah router provider uh, no no router provider and here we can pass the router in the form of this uh, uh, variable name uh, let me just uh, router provider after that we can give the router and inside that we can pass uh, this variable name copy this here paste here and let me just uh, close self element now our route will be set now you can see here uh, these are display and let's uh, add the more pages uh, first of all we add the home page for that uh, we give the route path for our home page will be slash or we can check when I was click here you can see in the, uh, this will be the display the dashboard for that here I can give the dashboard like that and here this will be the self closing and here give the element and inside we import the home here you can see in the top section it will be automatically imported and now the why this error is coming I want to check mm. ok here I was not close this that's why just close self closing this one and this dashboard will be done or we can give the slash and let me just close create an another page next page a gift let me just give the here gift and another will be the we create uh, what is the name order and pay another page will be the what is the name of the page uh, store 
and last one is the profile like that we have uh, done our uh, this section and let me just go on the pages here you can see we have uh, already created these pages and just I go on the let me just close all these things and when I was change this uh, home you can see our I think let me just go in the route and where is index.js okay no of the home no any URL like a home in the style but maybe something let me delete this if okay it will be redirect this dashboard and uh, when I was gone the gift it will be display the gift card I want to give the same path for making this here I was given the gift when I was change this gift gift you can see oh okay why gift is uh, okay everywhere has uh, I was not changing the component let me here I will give the gift card and here I can give this change the component also here I want to give the gift component and here I give the order order page component here I give the pay component and here I give the store component and make sure that your component will be uh, imported and now last one will be the profile mm, I was given the our profile now here all the component will be imported let me just come here refresh this okay why this gift will be not be display okay this will be the gift card for here right uh, gift cards now see it will be coming gift card but uh, why this will be not changing okay I was not set the outlet where all these uh, pages will be display for that I want to all these pages will be display here in the app.js here I want to import the outlet from the react router here I can give the outlet and here directly I can paste this and here you can see now it will display the gift when I just go on the another page uh, this order page uh, I can change this order okay now see this order page will be display when I was go on the pay this pay will be display and when I was go on the store last of our page will be the profile profile now see it will be display let's check the original one and here home will be display the dashboard gift wall will be display the gift card order will be display the ordering or we can give the ordering also no tension just copy this ordering or here we can give the ordering and uh, let's go on the page section if I just go on the page section then here display the before the login we do not click on the this page section and let's uh, we will do later go on the store store will be same no problem now our react router dom is all uh, set now let's create uh, this uh, top section uh, this top section navigation bar we create our in the component let me just close all this file uh, this file is too much open yeah we have closed this file and also this one now I want to go on the component first of all we created uh, this uh, top you can give the now bar or header but here I give the header uh, here go on the component folder and create a file header and header dot js now here I want to give the rafce for the jsx of uh, react like that now I want to import this uh, in the app dot js uh, because I want to give this in the every pages here I can set this uh, header from the component 
and here I come see header will be display here and this header will be you can see this header will be fixed for that uh, and I want to logo and here you can see it has uh, always uh, this types of a uh, what is the name of this uh, little bit space from the this top side and here this both uh, has uh, some spaces and here uh, in this uh, project I use the Talvin also I was I think forgot to install let me just install this go on here Talvin CSS go on the documentation and click on the start after that I want to go on the framework guidelines uh, and go on the create react uh, just do the same step which uh, here in the document is so just copy this first command and I can paste here and now installation is started I want to also npx create uh, this Talvin CSS paste here now this one done now I want to set up the our Telvin for that uh, I come here and in the module in the telvin.config.js I want to do this part just copy this here and go on the where is uh, telvin.config uh, uh, here and here inside the content just I want to paste this paste this here and any other more changes and here in the index.css just copy this here and go on the index.css here in the top section we can paste this and everything is now fine our uh, Talvin also set uh, for the uh, any class will be for that let's go on the creating the header first of all and here I want to the, this types of uh, these images uh, Starbuck logo instance just copy here and uh, we can copy the I can use the directly save this image let me just come here in T drive and where is my Starbuck folder Starbuck go on the SRC and here in the assist we can create a folder image inside this this image we can give the logo and dot png let me save this and this file is downloaded when I just go on the vs code in the assist folder you can see here logo dot png will be display like this this types of a now we have uh, logo is imported and I use uh, this types of icon like see this search one or other for that I use the react icon for that also install this react icon just come here and here and npx create this just copy this command and come here and here I want to do this paste here now we have uh, all the requirement will be I think done we will install later if anything say is remaining uh, doing this project and now first of all we created this navigation and this logo and this search let's go on the here header section and here uh, I give the first of all I want to also make uh, all this uh, uh, variable uh, for this giving the to giving all this color we d give the color will be later no problem but first of all we give the color um, I think I want to give uh, now um, this top color is I think let me just see the top color color code and this color will be white no problem and uh, what is the name of uh, this background color will be the when I was click here let me select this and here I was clicking this background color will be this and uh, I can copy this here and I think background color is uh, yeah everywhere this color Let me just go on here 
yeah this background color is fixed for that i can give the directly on the go on the index.js and in the index.css in the background body section i can give the background color will fix this one and here you can see this background color will be now change and any other things let me just see yeah i want to this green color code because here see this co this color and this color all this color code and for that i can mm, this is both are different color this will be dark and here it will be right uh, here i want to go select this key and just click here and here you can see this background color will be display this hover effect and uh, why these are not displaying let me just come here click here and yeah here this color code let me just copy this color code and uh, come in the tailwind here this tailwind config and in the extension section we can set the variable uh, what is the name of this uh, i can give the first of all this is a color and for the background color we can give the background bg or we can give go on the index dot uh, index dot js here i make a root we will say uh, later or uh, we set the all the variable later first of all we make the list of this we give the uh, bg green uh, 500 like that i think this are we give the bg rate 5000 and paste this color for now i pasting this for after that we can remove this don't worry only i want to know the color code that's why and for the hovering when i just click here and here let me just go back ok one color is done for me let's uh, make the first one i want to go on the close all this file and only i want to open the header section and here first of all i want to include the logo before that i want to import this images here import logo from i give the uh, go on the folder assist where is and inside this i want to go on the images after that i give the name of the this uh, images i give the logo dot png and here i can give the div class name and in uh, this inside the div we include the our image okay image src and inside this src section we give the this logo uh, let me just give this okay why these are not done and just close this self closing one well and let me just uh, okay i was not given i give the letter don't no problem i want to go on the dash boat like that and see here this image will be coming and now we have done this image part let me just go on the another section we i want to give the this navigation here i use a simple uh, HTML tag now and inside this I want to make a like this types of a now for that uh, all the now will be link uh, when I just click on the then it go on the different pages for that I can use the link tag uh, link component in the react router DOM you can see this link one and this link uh, make sure that imported from the react router DOM and now here I give the two and this will be go on the I think dashboard and here inside this I close this and inside I give the home and second one with the gift 
gift cards and here I give the gift let me just give the yeah and like that I want to just copy this and here give the order uh, this will be this ordering sorry ordering and here give the order I want to display the order and now here pay yeah pay Mm, here I give the pay after that this will be the store here also I give the store like that we have done this part now let me just show you here you can see all this will be when I click on the home it will be already home page when I click on the gift see here this text will be uh, this page will be changed and on this uh, Pay section, pay page will be op open and this route will also change. When I click on the store, here you can see this store page will be displayed below. Now let's uh, design this part. And in between that, you can see it has a space uh, for that. Here now we can use the Telvin CSR display flags. And uh, let me just see. And I can use uh, here class name will be the flags and why these are not done flags and this will be okay let me refresh I go on to why these are not happening why this Telvin CSS is not work uh, let me just see the background color red I think I want to restart this again. Mm. npx create react sorry npm start yeah now it's working and let me close all these things uh, and here uh, yeah this will be dark and let me just remove the background color now here you can see uh, in the this section and this section has a uh, spaces for that we want to give the some space and also we make a response you also for that uh, when I just reduce you can see this space will be reduces like that and for that medium size it has I think fixed number of a space or we can give the here uh, where is here I make a header header inside this just cut here and go on the bottom here before this now just paste here make the format press the shift alt f now this will be automatically format and in the header uh, section I give the class name and here I give the BG uh, background color will be white uh, white now let me just see here you can see this white but uh, I want to give the full width here I give the width full and here I was not given width full yeah here you can see this width will be full and here you can see the I it has a little bit shadow from them for that I can give the uh, shadow uh, I want to give shadow from uh, this header will be he only for this and here we can remove this now because only this much is for here here I give the BG white and I was given this width and here give the BG red for knowing purpose how much and here I want to also include the width but here I give the width will be approximately 90% of the screen in the desktop version 
and this md will be contain press the this md will be the approximately 570 and we can give the md uh, width will be approximately uh, 90 percent yeah you can see this suggestion will be not complete coming here for that i can use the some extension like a telvin css and just come here and install this and uh, i think this thumbnail will be also be not looking proper for that we can change this we can use the material thumbnail then install this part now let me just show this you can choice this part now this thumbnail is looking good 